everyone, this is Jamie Sorensen here at Two Peas in a Bucket with another weekly warehouse walk video. This week I am showing you some product that is on sale. We have lots of Prima goodies on sale, so I'm going to show you some of that. Um, before we get started, I want to say congrats to Tigger Fan 6 She's our winning commenter from last week. So thanks so much for watching. Um, there are other Tigger fans around here, as there are lots of Disney fans. Um, so let's get started with Prima. We have lots of Prima on sale, um, and Prima has a wide variety of products. Three Prima fans, I'm sure you know. Um, first, showing you some of the canvas pieces. They have these cool accents in different shapes that have that nice canvas texture, and then they have an adhesive back. So don't miss the sale going on. Here's an example of one of their felt gate pieces. I've seen lots of cool things done with these. The front of mini albums and um, little embellishments within parts of the designs. I've seen people do lots of cool stuff. There's also, um, Donna Downey has some designs of Prima, and these. this is an example of one of the iron-on pieces. Lots to look at. They're, they come with different designs within the pack, and then there's a, a sheet of instructions, too. So you can kind of see, it looks like this design comes in a couple different colors. Here's another one. That one is called Frame Flocked. So these have a flock texture to them, it looks like some of them do. Butterflies. She also has a whole series of words. Be cool to put on a little canvas purse or something. Oops, sorry. Family. Looks like there's a lot of different words. Inspire, memories, love, etc. So, let's move on now to some of the blue bin stuff. Okay, so on this side of me and on this side of me, there's lots of Prima going on here. So, I can't possibly show all of it, but I will show you a little sampling of different things. Um, Prima has lots of different rhinestone designs, and they're a nice, good size. Um, so if you aren't familiar with these, a lot of the designs, there's like a string of adhesive. So um, it makes the design really easy. You can just peel and stick. They come in different shapes, different swirl designs, different colors. Here's a cool one. Different figures. Silhouettes. They also have some that include different pieces. I've seen some of these gems with um, flowers incorporated. Here are some different lace. Show you some of the different kinds of flowers. Now if there were any kind of flower imaginable, Prima has done it. Um, they have different ribbon pieces and even some jewelry I'll show you later, but then they have all different kinds of flower designs with different textures, patterns, colors, centers. Even in this pack, there's different kinds of centers within the flowers. These are a nice kind of silky feel. These are called Bubblegum Louisa May Alcots. There are some fun ones with different um, Kitty is laughing at me. That was a long name. Sorry. <laughs> a long name for a, a flower, she's saying. So anyway, these are some fun um, crocheted pieces, and then some are just different fabrics. <laughs> these are cool. Um, have some nice dimension. These are the Sherbert. Oh dear, why did I pick this name? Colin Show. Kitty, help me. I don't know. <laughs> but I've seen people use this backing. Um, they've cut this part off and they've used even this clear piece as a part of their design. So those are really fun. Here's another set. These are the letter roses, love letter roses. Appropriately named Juliet. I know I'm sorry, that's Jude. I'm pretty sure there's a Juliet too. 
These are the guava peony waltz. And these are some lemonade Bronte blooms. So, very fun. You can get some that have a variety of colors in them and then some also that are monochromatic. So you can think about what you're, what you're looking for. Now let's move on to some of the um, scrapbook jewelry. This is some of the scrapbook jewelry. I think I've shown you these before. Um, but these you could use, I'm seeing scrapbook products used often for different accessories. You can also put them on your page and then it does have a clasp at the end. Um, different designs and styles. They also have these stencil, um, they're calling them mask sets. So they come in a little booklet attached with a brad on the end here. I'll open one up and show you. You can see on the back of this packaging, these are the other sets that are available. They come with, I believe, five in each set. So you can take these and then use your spray mists or ink or whatever you'd like to use to get artsy and use these as a mask for them. So very intricate designs. Very cool. Okay. I'm going to show you some more from, let's go over to this side and see what's over here. Um, some of the stamps. They also have stamps, along with a lot of flowers. Um, and then they come with a little rhinestone set. This one is called Cornell 4x6 stamp. This is Fontology. Sounds like it's gonna have something with language. Yep. Very pretty. Here is another one. This one has a little B in the middle. So it looks like they have different words in them and then a couple different frames. This one is Songbird. All right, so let's look at a few different things. Oh, you know what I didn't show you? Here are the, and these are brown butterflies with clips. So they actually click in the center there. Um, they have cream. Oh, Kitty's showing the back. She pulls this, so she knows. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Kitty. Mm -hmm. Some yellow. And then, you know what we didn't show are those strand things. Where are those? The long... You know what I'm talking about? Oh, these. Some Sprays. of the branches, the sprays. We're just helping each other out today. <laughs> okay, so that was icicle, and it did look like very icicle. This one's pretty. Gold glistening vines. Iridescent glistening vines. My friend Autumn, she's an interior designer. She's awesome. She takes things like that and she puts them in her Christmas tree. She, her husband was making fun of her for spray painting twigs and then putting them in her Christmas tree. <laughs> so she could, I could see her using these. Okay, all right, so I think that's a wrap for today. Thanks so much for joining me and I will see you next week. Oh, and don't forget to leave a comment on my blog today for um, your chance to win a product from some of the Prima goodies I've shown you. And check out the sale. There's lots on sale. See you next week.